It's a really nice morning. We're actually gonna try our hand at getting some shark breaching, where they tow a decoy behind the boat and get the sharks actually jumping out of the water. The best time to do this is sunrise and sunset, so that's why we're out early this morning. We're gonna leave Shark Cage here for a little while. The sun's just coming up, so we've got a little bit more light now. We're just putting a, a fish oil slick in the water at the moment. This will give us the best chance of getting sharks around when it comes to the dive. The cage is sinking slightly here for a second. I'm shin deep in water. <laughs> Probably a few sharks around here. <laughs> well, this morning we're coming back through Shark Alley where we were yesterday. We'll drop the decoy in and we'll start to tow it at a slow speed and we should start to see if the sharks are onto it. This is the worst part. Waiting, waiting for them to strike. I sat on the back of the boat for so long and you have to stay like that without moving. So it's just constant concentration and you're kind of quivering with excitement. Your fingers locked on the trigger button. Probably been sitting here for the last 40 minutes to an hour just staring at this decoy, just waiting for the shark to hit it. Oh man, I'm almost going blind looking at that decoy. I've been Ellis's tripod for the past hour actually. I've been sitting in this position for over an hour now. My arm just keeps aching, but the moment that shark jumps, it makes it all worthwhile. This is the best part, just watching it and just knowing this poor little decoy out there is just going to get mauled by a shark at any moment. To be here in South Africa and to capture this moment for myself is a pretty special thing. But when you have to hold that camera for an hour or two in the same position without moving, you start to think, oh, well, it's never coming. And the moment it left, I just forgot about the last hour and a half, aching muscles, dizzy, staring through the viewfinder. All of that was worth it for that one second. No warning at all, shot, clean up the water, just fantastic. Just blew me away. I still feel excited about getting in the water with the shark, but now I'm a little bit apprehensive. Is that the tick box? Yeah, man. You can see there's some serrated cuts there, 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 and there. I should have been more scared at that point to get in the water with them, and yet I was actually more amazed by the shark than I had ever been. 